Welcome to Mr. V Teaching Math. In this session, we're going to review one of the more difficult uses of formulas in which they give you some of the work and you're going to have to go backwards. In this case, we have a rectangle. A reminder that these are called, we call them hash marks in our classroom and they indicate that those lines or line segments are the same length. So wait, since this is 12, we know this is 12. In this diagram, they have not given us the width. And let's say that we are told that the perimeter is equal to 72 centimeters. And now we're asked, what is the width? How does one calculate this? As with all the work that we're doing, in this unit, you start with the formula. The formula for the perimeter of a rectangle, perimeter is equal to two times the length plus two times the width. Now, in this question, they have given us some information. They have told us what the length is. We know that the length is 12. They've also told us that the perimeter is 72. That goes here. We do not know what the width is. This now becomes an algebra question where we want to find out what W is. The first step is we're going to simplify the question using some of the things we've learned earlier. On this side of the equation, I will attempt bed mass. First, brackets, none, exponents. Sorry, I should say there is one, but there's nothing I can do inside those brackets. Exponents, there are none. Division multiplication, yes, I have multiplication here and multiplication here, and I always go left to right. Can I do this? Yes, I can. So I'm gonna do two times 12, that's gonna give me 24. And I can try to do that sequence again. Brackets, exponents, division, multiplication. I have divi multiplication right here. However, 2 times w I can't do. So I cannot simplify the question anymore using that technique. Now I need to get w by itself. I have two things to get rid of. I have 2 times w and I have adding 24. You must remember that when doing algebra, it's a backwards kind of question. You have the answer. You're trying to find the question. So, you will do your bed mass in reverse order. So, I'm going to start by getting rid of things so that W is all by itself. The first thing I'm going to get rid of is the adding and subtraction. To get rid of adding 24, I will do the opposite. I will subtract 24. And my mu equation must remain balanced. Whatever I do to one side, you must do to the other. I will also subtract 24 from this side. The adding 24 and the subtracting 24 will cancel each other out, leaving me with only 2 times w. Then I can simply do 72 subtract 24. Again, I'm going to continue. I need w by itself. I need to get rid of 2 times w. To get rid of timesing by 2, I will divide by 2. Keep your equation balanced. Whatever you do to one side, you must do to the other. Leaves me with w and 12. Of course, you undoubtedly have realized that my drawing is not accurate. In reality, if this is 12, we're actually looking at a square. However, this is how to do the work. I'm sure that some of you, when looking at the original question, could have solved this in your head. However, when we're working with the more complicated formulas, particularly when we're looking at the volume formulas and some of the other formulas we'll be learning later on that are quite complicated, you will need to do this kind of work. Don't forget, that you can check to see if you've done your algebra correctly by going back and reworking the question in what we call left side, right side. Go 
going back to the original left side of the equation, which was 72. Going back to the original right side of the equation, 2 times 12 plus 2 times w. We can then work through the question using what we think w actually is. So I will take my answer for w and put it here. And then we shall see if this works. 2 times 12 will give me 48. No, it doesn't. Silly me. 24. 2 times 12 gives me 24. This gives me 48. As you can see, I have done something wrong. Can you identify where the mistake is? Here. 48 divided by 2 is not 12. This is actually 24. And my drawing is still wrong, because this is 24, which would make that the longest side. And that is a review of how to do algebra in this unit.